Hey guys, uh, today we're going to do a very quick video on how to use the Google Nexus Player uh, remote in the Kodi. Uh, or you might say, I already know everything about uh, Kodi, right? Uh, and I use Google Nexus Player, so it works fine. Yeah, but how do you access the right click kind of a menu on the Google Nexus Player remote control here? As you see on the remote control here, it has on the top the search speech uh, button and on this uh, the round wheel you have left, right, up, down in the middle is OK, right, or confirm and this button here is cancel or exit the right one is play or pause this one with the circle on it that goes to home the Nexus Player's homepage. So where is the menu button? So, like, why do you need menu button? For example, here, when you search for something, a title in Kodi, like Planet Earth here, you need to bookmark it so that it goes to your favorites. Next time you don't have to search again. How do you access the right menu context button uh, menu? If it's on the PC, you can just right-click the mouse. On um, any kind of an Android TV box, on the uh, complicated remote, like the, those sophisticated remote control, you have a menu button right on the remote. Here, with this uh, simplicated, simplified actually, <laughs> uh, remote control, you don't have anything like that. So what do you do? So basically, um, there are two ways to do that. One, in Kodi, there is actually a uh, add-on called something called like a uh, remote remap or something like that. Search for it because what it does is it access the Kodi's remote control uh, XM, XML file so that you can edit it. So you can reassign some of the buttons to be the menu button. For example, you can reassign this play and pause button to be um, when you press it, it goes to menu. Um, but the problem with that is first one, first of all, First of all, it's very complicated. You have to find the file. First, you have to, because it's a system file, you have to uh, make it show. It's, it's hidden, right? Then you have to copy it out, edit it with the plain text editor, then copy it back. And secondly, also, that way, this button becomes very complicated. Sometimes you want to play, but it shows menu. Sometimes you want a menu, it shows, it, it will play the, or pause. So the better way, without doing anything, is just long press the OK or Confirm button here. So right here we have selected, we, we highlighted Planet Earth 2, for example. We want to save it to our favorites. Just long press, pre keep press and hold the center button. And there you go. This is the menu. So we're going to go to Add to Favorites and click, click OK again. It basically adds it to your favorites. Next time you don't have to search for it again. So simple as that. So if you search online, you can find both methods mentioned, but the latter one definitely is the easiest one to do.